Throughout time, weebs have often found themselves inside of tricky situations upon realizing that the hot anime girl that they were just fapping to was actually a man. This has caused countless weebs to go through existential dread and question their sexualities. However, there is nothing to fear, as I have come with my overly convenient explanation that we can prove that traps are not gay through the use of pH levels. The concept of pH originates in chemistry, and what its purpose is, is to assign a numerical value to how acidic or basic a compound is. This is determined through the use of a pH test, often on litmus paper that then changes colors, which then gives you a numerical value for the pH of said compound. This pH value is then placed on a scale that goes from basic to acidic. It is possible to turn a compound more basic or more acidic depending on what you add to it. For example, whenever a dangerous substance is spilled inside the streets, let's say some form of corrosive acid is spilled in the streets, what authorities do to clean this up is they will go and then pour basic materials on it in order to neutralize the substance and therefore make it harmless. So now, how does this apply to traps? Well, I don't know if you noticed, but the pH scale I showed earlier is actually remarkably similar to the gay scale. Now, many people before have said that the fact that traps have a penis instantly puts them to the far left on the gay scale. But I'm here to present you with an alternative argument. You see, the fact is that traps look like girls. And if we take into account the girly clothing, the luscious hair, and the beautiful facial features, then I think that you'll find that it's actually not as gay as you may have initially thought. In fact, based on my findings here, it goes right in the middle of the gay scale, which is in between being gay and not gay. It would seem as though traps almost don't conform to this dual system. Either way, it would appear as though traps are not gay.